something this execution or... is called madhi this discharge is called madhi which is also viscid and thick but it is not similar to al-mani with regards to the requirement of performing ghusl al-mani or the semen which is ejaculated as a result of stimulation or sexual intercourse or um, personal stimulation uh, to the point that there is a complete erection and ejaculation then that's called uh, mani which requires ghusl you have to perform ghusl but your case is called madhi and al madhi is also a sexual discharge as a result of thinking about uh, you know intimacy or whatever but it is not coming out or poured forth the same way the sexual discharge of al mani is done so in this case it will be required to wash your private and if your underclothes were soiled with that that spot should be purified or washed off and then you perform wudu and offer your prayer very normal this is not a many which requires ghost barakallahu feekum and uh, there is a hadith in this regard with a, uh, narrated by ali ibn abi talib he used to experience the condition that you mentioned but he was embarrassed to ask the prophet because of his position because he was married to his daughter so he asked somebody else to present the question to the Prophet ﷺ and he said it will be sufficient to perform wudu.